despite some comments from their CEO, Toyota is going all in on electric vehicles. Case in point, this concept car. This is the BZ4X, and yes, that is a bit of a weird name. The BZ stands for Beyond Zero, which will be a new all-electric sub-brand for Toyota. The 4X, well, it's a crossover, four doors, all-wheel drive. Here's what it's all about. So at this stage, we don't really know much about the production car that this concept is going to spawn. We know that it'll arrive sometime in the middle of next year and that it will run on electricity and that it will have a battery pack and that it'll ride atop an all new, all exclusive, all electric platform. And that there will be a new infotainment system. But beyond that, we don't know range, we don't know power. So if you're here for that information, I'm, I'm sorry, we just don't have anything yet. But what we can go through is the design. So when this car arrives in production form, broadly speaking, it's going to look like this. That's, that's fine by us. The BZ4X, besides, besides its silly name, is a pretty good looking car. I like this somewhat Mirai inspired front end, this longer hood, which you don't really need in an EV, but we're glad Toyota did it. It adds some flavor. The mix of colors here is really great. I love the black with the gray, it's good. And especially if they offer it in other colors, black and gold, black and white, black and red. This could be a very good looking car when it finally arrives. If you look at the profile, this is a two box crossover. It is longer than a RAV4, but lower and wider. But that does the proportions a lot of favors. From the side, it is an attractive thing. There are interesting creases in the sheet metal. It is more expressive than a RAV4 or even a Venza, but it's not so polarizing as to remind us of the Prius Prime, which is a little bit too fussy for my taste. But my favorite angle is from the back. There are some really great elements back here. I love the cam back design. It just stops. This dual element rear spoiler, spoilers, are there two of them? I don't know. It looks great. It's expressive. It's different. You're not going to see anything like this on the roads, especially not on a crossover. This light bar, ties in with current design trends and it's, yeah, it's fine. But overall, this is a interesting design, especially from the back. So here we are in the interior and as you can see, I am not sitting in it. That is because again, this is a concept car. Toyota's asked us not to sit in it, which is a shame because it looks like a pretty nice cabin. There's some interesting material choices. The overall design is clean and simple and modern. There's a new 14 inch, I think vaguely 14 inch display running a new version of Toyota's infotainment that will eventually filter down to the rest of the range. Some of the controls are somewhat familiar. The steering wheel feels like it could have come right out of a Prius. That's fine, it does the job. This instrument cluster is small, but it packs a fair amount of information. It's running a demo setup right now, but what we can see is information for driver assistance technologies, speedometer, charge level, amount of energy that you're using at the time and all the other usual bits like a clock and an external temperature and an odometer. Again, we don't know what technologies this vehicle is going to have when it arrives, but you can see right here, there is the camera system for driver monitoring. That could mean a version of Lexus's teammate hands-free driving technology. We don't know that for certain. I'm just kind of guessing at this point. When the BZ4X goes on sale next year, it'll do battle with the Nissan Aria, the Ford Mustang Mach-E, Tesla Model 3, and Volkswagen ID4. We're expecting competitive range and performance from the production model. But for right now, what's clear is that Toyota is making a big step forward after years of only selling hybrids and plug-in hybrids. This is the vehicle that it needs, but it's the first of many. For more on the BZ4X and Toyota's electrification efforts, be sure to check out MotorOne.com and follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and wherever else you get your social media.